Hi, today I'm going to show you how to use a spinner using Fireweeds. So let's start. Open your Android Studio. Click on Start a New Android Studio Project. Select Empty Activity. Click on Next. Name of your application Spinner Fireweeds. Click on finish. Now we connect our uh, Android Studio with our Firebase. So click on tools, Firebase. Click on real time database, save and retrieve the data, connect to Firebase. Your login ID of Android Studio must be same as your Firebase login ID. Click on connect to Firebase. Now green tick means your Firebase is connected to your Android Studio. Now open your Firebase console. Here you can see that your project is created. Click on spinner. Firebase, click on database, click on create database, next, done. Now we click on real time database and we create our database here. A database is created. Now we add some data. Example is spinner. Add one name. Diksha. Click on add. Similarly, I am going to add some other element. Two name. ABC at three name XYZ at four name PQR at Now back to our Android Studio. Click on RES layout. Activity main.xml. Now we add the real time database to our app. Accept the changes. As we can see that dependency set up correctly. Now click on Gradle and build.gradle model app. Here we change 19 and 2.1 and click on sync now. Then we click on build.gradle project level. Here we change 4.3.3 and click on sync now. Now move back to activity main.xml. Then I'm going to use table layout. Create one row. Table row. Layout height. That contain. Layout width. Match parent ID table row. Text view. Can we write name? Text size twenty SP. 
text color i'm taking black color which is the hash code of black color now i'm going to add one spinel layout height wrap contain build 252 dp id spinner and uh, spinner mode drop down and closed now click on java main activity here we take spinner spinner database reference database reference spinner equals to find by vid r dot id dot spinner database reference equals to five is database dot get instance dot get reference now database reference dot child here we take a spinner spinner dot add value event new value event listener now we create one list of type a string names names new array list now we take the variable which type of string the spinner name equals to data snapshot dot child here we take name name dot get value sorry get value string dot class and aims dot at spinner name now we create one adapter add adapter of type string array adapter now array adapter define array adapter here new 
Very adaptive. Main activity dot this from an Android dot R dot layout dot simple. Spinner item. Comma. Names. Now, Harry. We have to define this under on change on data change. Now array adapter. dot set drop view resource android dot r dot layout dot simple inner item as spinner dot set adapter array adapter I'm going to in the project why oh, forgot to Paste copy the Google version file. Go to the file is console project setting. Download Google version file. Copy here project. under the app folder click on ok since we want to add all the names we have to add for loop here for data snapshot Try snap short data snapshot dot get data snapshot. dot get children and put this code under the for loop now we run the project before run we have to change it try the snapshot and again run the project Here you can see that list of name Diksha ABC XYZ TQR. Thank you.